people watch my watch my videos, they think, oh Dan, I find you so motivational. I'm not a motivational guy. I'm not an inspirational guy. I'm a skill guy. Because I know skills, that's what gives you true confidence. The whole book is about financial confidence, not financial freedom. Please write it down. Financial freedom is bullshit. It is bullshit. It does not exist. I used to believe it exists. It's a myth. It's an illusion. Not a popular thing to say, but I'm saying it. Because I used to believe it. It's not true. When I say the word financial freedom, what picture comes to mind? Right, right. A beach. You're sitting on. Uh, you're sitting on the. What is it? The, what's it called? The swing thing. What's it called? Yeah, so that's right. And then you're drinking your what? Yeah, okay, that's right. A beer or something, right? People think of that's financial freedom. I did that. Bought out of my mind. You got sunburned in two days. And you look at the ocean, the first day is cool, second ocean, you say to yourself, this is stupid. This is boring. Like, it's boring, bought out of my mind, and I'm like, now I, I don't look good when I'm like 10. Like, I, like it's all red, and I, you know, your skin pills, it's a bad day. I'm like, I work hard for this? For what? I don't understand. I really don't understand. So let me ask you this. Do you have the freedom to go to different places if you want to? The, the freedom of mobility, yes? yes? Do you have the freedom of speech? They you can express your opinions, okay? So why are we seeking something that is so elusive when we're already free? Oh, but then I don't have enough money to buy whatever I want, to own whatever I want, to travel in the style that I want to travel. I get that. That's an income thing. But I'm not talking about that. So financial freedom is an illusion, it doesn't exist. And although I know maybe Rich Dad Poor Dad Kiyosaki talks about when your investments, when you have enough passive income coming in, that exceeds your expense, that you're, you're free. You've heard that before, yes? Right, you've heard that before? That's what he talks about in the book. I think passive income makes you lazy. I think passive income, it's almost so poisonous in some way. So passive income is, is, is a myth. Right down, just because something is passive doesn't mean it's permanent. So you've got some passive income coming in from some online website, you're selling something. Let's see how long that lasts. Three months, six months, a year. You got a property producing passive income. You lose a tenant, your passive income suddenly goes to zero. In fact, it goes to negative, right? So that's not passive. When you manage a property, it takes work, right? Even Airbnb, it takes some freaking work. So forget that concept. A much better concept is financial confidence. Now I'm talking about something completely different. If you, you get nothing, nothing else from my talk, financial confidence, that's the truth. What does it mean? The answer, what's the difference? Financial confidence versus financial freedom. Financial confidence, write it down, it's income on demand. That knowing you have the confidence, the ability, you can go anywhere, anything, any industry, and you can make money. I don't need a government, I don't need a company, I don't need an industry, I don't even need my business to provide. I can provide. I make me money. Give me nothing. Nothing. Take away everything I have, doesn't matter. Any business I could go in, I could sell. I could generate revenue. Doesn't matter what it is. That's truth confidence. No one could take that away from me. Does that make sense? So develop that. That's the truth. The financial confidence.